Hi, it's Kevin King with GemCar. Today I just want to touch base on gross margin and gross profit. It's normally a conversation that comes up a little later on with shops as I'm working with them. But let's say you have a shop and you're doing a million dollars in sales and you have a healthy bottom line of 10%, that, that's going to make $100,000 of profit. If you took that same math and you took a part that was $10 and you wanted to mark it up 40%, some shops would tell me, well, that means I'm going to sell it for $14. That's only $4 of gross profit though, and the difference between the margin and the gross profit is if you calculated the cost by your selling price, the actual margin is 28%. So imagine in GemCard, you could put in, so you don't have to worry about what your service advisors are doing, how they're calculating a 50% gross profit or a 40% markup, because they're on the opposite ends of what you're going to get on the bottom line at the end of the day. But in GemCard, you can put in what you want for a default margin and give very specific training to your employees that all they need to do is go to the website, transfer it into the software, let the software handle the pricing, and quote the prices that are there. It helps give pricing integrity across your counter and also reinsures to your customers that you're running a, a nice operation and very consistent and it will help your bottom line to be more profitable at the end of the day.